Ambassadors and senior diplomats from 50 African countries visited China's largest and the world's fifth human vaccine R&D and manufacturing enterprise Sinopharm CMBG. The visit aimed to deepen cooperation in the fight against the pandemic and build a better China-Africa health community. The diplomats visited the exhibition center and vaccine production lab, and learned about the latest clinical trials of the company's COVID-19 vaccine. This visit is so much impactful and insightful, and we've learned so much the greatness of China, how China is moving forward and moving. This uh, great uh, uh, nation forward, and also making sure that um, Africa is well and safe. And so, this cooperation, I believe, can empower Africa the more, can strengthen that relationship the more. It, it is、uh, you know, reassuring to see how big the facility is, how you know much experience、uh, this organization, this company, subsidiary of Sinopharm, has accumulated over a period of time, developing vaccines、uh, on polio, on, on, on yellow fever, on new fox, and other. Other smallpox and many other diseases that have been, you know, are treated using or prevented using the vaccines developed by this organization. So for us, it's an eye opener. It's reassuring, and we hope that we、we'll、get the vaccine end time soon. Sinopharm is currently carrying out the international phase three clinical trials for a COVID-19 vaccine in ten countries, including the UAE, Peru, and Argentina. More than 50,000 volunteers are taking part in these trials. Back in May, Chinese President Xi Jinping said China will make any COVID-19 vaccine that develops a global public good that is accessible. And affordable to developing countries, especially African countries, and he said priority must be given to helping African countries with weaker healthcare systems. Since the outbreak of COVID-19 in Africa, the Chinese government has provided more than 400 tons of medical supplies to the continent. Nearly 200 medical experts have also been deployed there to train more than 20,000 African medical personnel. China also has 1,100 cooperative. Projects in Africa, including bridges, roads, ports, and hospitals. Liu Yang, CGTN, Beijing.